welcome back to our channel, the channel for the latest news and stories about the Princess of Wales, Princess Catherine and her royal family. Today, we bring you breaking news, William and Catherine holding hands moment. Prince and Princess of Wales have been seen holding hands while they went towards a gala dinner alongside a moment taken by the cameras. Princess Catherine is accessorized with large earrings, a leather satchel and a gorgeous vampire gown. While wearing a tuxedo, Prince William, he also appears ideal for a state dinner. The Prince and Princess of Wales holding hands moment is seen as quite unusual. We were quite lucky to capture this joyful moment. We witnessed the royal couple of Wales holding hands on another occasion. Prior to beginning their full day of events in Blackpool, England, the Royal Couple of Wales engaged with a few moments of PDA at residence. In an undated video recorded by a bystander and posted by supporters' accounts on Instagram, Catherine and William had been seen casually holding hands as they strolled through the grounds of the palace and proceeded to get their chopper. This was a comprehensive tender moment between the prince and princess. Maybe that's because they are nevertheless at the residence before embarking on official duties. The pair seldom displays PDA throughout their formal events. Previous sightings have included a casual hand on each other's backs or a brush of the elbow. William and Catherine are much more likely to maintain their hands to themselves throughout formal business activities than Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, who openly cuddle or connect arms on their media interviews. According to politeness experts, there is no legal convention prohibiting PDA. It primarily relies on desire and the kind of occasion the members of the royal family are participating in. Nevertheless, they are following the example of William's father, King Charles, in addition to the deceased Queen and Prince Philip, who tend to be considerably more restrained in publicity whenever it pertains to public shows of devotion. Additionally, while official precedent may have had an impact on the Prince and Princess of Wales' choice to maintain their lover secret, one analyst thinks there is probably a bit more to this story than that. The pair has indeed been caught off guard, holding hands joyfully at a typical couple, according to body language specialists who additionally maintained that their choice never to hold hands when outdoors is a deliberate one. Consequently, they frequently choose the more sensation PDAs, including back rubs or delicately placing their arms around their partner's waists when attending meetings or conducting formal rural activity. The above actions demonstrate strong feelings of love and attachment. Therefore, there could be a compelling explanation for avoiding the hand clasp, she explains. When there are several hands to shake and numerous individuals to meet at the same time, the hand clutching as senior members of the royal family at gatherings can be perceived as a cumbersome routine. The pair are unwilling to offend individuals that they are now with, the expert continues. Even though hand-holding seems considered as loving, he says, at their level, holding hands might render them appear restricted, but instead of appropriately outgoing too. William and Catherine, who will soon become the King and Queen of the United Kingdom, seem to be working ambassadors of the British royal family, and frequently abstain from showing affection to others in order to stay professional. Although Catherine raised her hand on William's knee, as well as the couple held hands during Princess Eugenie's engagement in October, that was the final time we witnessed such overt PDA between both the Cambridges. The pair were free to become close because the wedding was indeed a family occasion, as opposed to a participation. Thank you for watching today's video. What do you think of the exchange of affection between them? Would you like to witness more of the couple's current and future moments? Please share your ideas with us. And for now, I bid you farewell.